story where it's so well loved and 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 the pressure is in, immense. But at the same time, dahil ang taas ng stakes, ang saya at ang exciting niya din i... Uh, ang saya niya din adventure to start on. Especially if you know na yung teammates mo, super well supported ka, and everyone loves the story as much as you, and respects it as much as you. So, we're all just very, very grateful and very excited. Um, ako po, Nung nalaman ko parang gusto ko na. Sumigaw talaga ako sa orto. <laughs> sa totoo lang. Dahil parang inano ko na talaga. Kung pag uh, nung pinasa ko po talaga siya. Talagang dabang-dabang na talaga. Tapos nung nalaman yung mga characters. Parang ano, yung pala po nga ako yung taong kala ko, kala ko talaga i-portray. So, sobra, so sobrang, <laughs> sobrang um, overwhelming po. And nervous, totoo lang. Kabado po talaga ako. Dahil, yun nga po, ang daming mga imaginations, expectations. Pero of course, ito ako. So I'll be playing Kira and I hope na yun po, makakustuhan po ng lahat. Yun po. Um, yan, ako naman po, uh, very thankful po talaga ako. Katulad ko na sinabi na grateful po sa Viva to guys, sa everyone po na part ng series na to na naging part po ako. Um, una po sa lahat, very excited kasi um, isa po ako sa napili para gumana po sa character um, sa The Rain. And um, very nervous din po. Siyempre, malaki po yung expectations ng readers kasi napakalawak po talaga and napaka dami po ng readers na ng book na to and of course yung buong series pero na mas nangingibabaw po yung happiness kasi uh, first time ko po rin gagampanan yung ganitong classic role um, different po siya sa mga roles na I did in the past so yun, I'm very excited po talaga para dito and I'm super happy po sa cast and kay Derek kasi um, kahit first time, halos first time po namin magka-work lahat grabe po yung um, bond namin and comfortable na po ako sa kanya Ako naman po, nagulat ako kasi yung um, matagal pa eh, bago na-reveal kung sino yung mga uh, gaginap kasi nag-audition tapos nagpa, ano pa sila, public audition. So ako, hindi ko na ina-expect. And then, dumating, bam! Huh? Wow! <laughs> kasi this is my first big role. So, ayun, kinakabahan din ang pressure at the same time. But, also thankful, syempre, kasi dumating na itong blessing na to, and I'll be working with these wonderful people, directors, uh, directors, ang dami? Director! <laughs> syempre, si Guay, and the, the production, everyone. I'm so thankful. Um, ako po, I feel, I just feel very blessed because, again, I just signed with Viva, and then I think a uh, few weeks after, uh, they called me for a script reading, di ba, Derek? And then after nun, parang few days after, nag-send na sila ng schedule na parang, ay, talaga, agad-agad, nakakatuwa naman, uh, sobrang uh, blessing talaga. So, sobrang na-excite po ako. And again, katulad ng sinabi nila, uh, yung, yung pressure and yung uh, nervousness is always there because for me, number one, this is my first project outside of um, my network before. And uh, pangalawa, uh, uh, we all know how much love and support uh, the Reign in España and the whole university series received online. So, syempre, uh, alam naman namin na malaking, kumbaga, malaking, malaki yung pupunan namin. Dahil marami talagang expectations bilang from written literature, katulad na sina sinasabi ni Derek. Meron, kumbaga, may iba't ibang imagination, may iba't ibang ideas yung mga readers about about our characters. So, syempre, uh, yung pressure po nandun that uh, we have we really have to do a good job and we have to really give justice to the role because a lot of people uh, is uh, really looking forward for this. Um, ako naman po, sobrang, sobrang masaya po talaga ako. Yung puso ko talaga eh, kung pwede lang tumalon, tumatalon na siya kanina pa. Kasi, um, alam naman po natin na sobrang dami nangyari this past few years. And sobrang grateful ako na nabigyan ako ng chance na gampanan si Luna. And I hope sa ating mga viewers, um, 
Wag po kayo mag-alala, hindi, hindi, hindi natin babaguhin si Luna. Kung ano yun yung imagine nyo kay Luna, yun ang makikita nyo kay Luna. Um, sa akin po, eh, sobrang happy ako na sila yung mga castmates ko, ang director ko, ang writer. Sobrang, sobrang thankful ako. And excited na ako mag-tape yung so Gusto ko na mag-taping at masimulan to at makita natin yung resulta. So, yun po. Um, I'm gonna be honest, uh, I didn't really know uh, this story because I don't read a lot. So uh, when I was told actually that I was gonna audition, bu Boss Veronique for a couple of months, she was telling me, hey Marco, you're gonna audition for Rain in Espana, and I was like, mm, okay. <laughs> you know, I didn't, I wasn't really familiar. And then when I auditioned, and uh, a couple of weeks after I got the role, um, I read the, the, not the script, I read the book, and I really, really liked the book, by the way, because, you know, they told me it was a kind of a rom-com kind of story, and, you know, I've been working on rom-com in this industry, and to, sometimes it's just too cheesy for me. Um, but this one, I was actually getting really happy about the book, because every single thought of every single character was so realistic. And I really, really did appreciate that, that I was giving, uh, I, I was giving a project like that, um, props to you, um, why. So, um, that, and then as well as, there was, um, the part, the process was really, um, kind of like, it, it was a slow process for me uh, until in thinking that it was a big project because there was so much preparation on the workshop and the details that they were giving about every single character, so many meetings on preparation before the workshop and script readings, and, um, but there was one sinking moment that made me really, really happy. Um, a friend of mine knew about the story and I told that I was gonna cast as Calix, and uh, she's from the province. Um, actually, it's a guy, but then she, uh, he had a cousin that was a little girl, like. 12 and another one 15 and then when they knew about it they were telling the parents and the family about who Calix and the story was and these two girls they were just shouting and screaming and speaking in uh, Bisaya I think and they were like really really happy and the excitement that I saw in those kids was what made sink in into my heart that this is probably the biggest project I've ever done and the most exciting, because there's so much excitement behind it, and I'm really, really happy that I got this role. So, yeah, that. Hello, um, ako naman po, pinaka naramdaman ko po noong una, kaba. Hindi naman po mawawala yung kaba sa atin kapag may mga nagbibigay po sa ating mga tungkulin. Kaya yun po, pinaka una ko naramdaman noong kaba. Tapos, narealize ko po na, oh my God, meron nung project. Meron akong, meron akong blessing. Kaya tontuwa ako nun. Tapos, siyempre sobrang saya ako nun. Binalita ako kailang mami. Kaya pagkatakas ko balita ako kailang mami, yun na, nandun na. Tapos, nagkaroon na kami ng mga script reading. Yan, tapos, nakapaghangod kami nung buong cast. Kaya, naging komportable na rin ako. Kaya, very excited na ako para mag-taping kami lahat para dito sa show na. Hey guys, um, how do I feel? I feel like... <laughs> Sorry, it's an inside joke. Um, hmm. um, similar to Marco, because I don't read a lot. Um, but I know why. So, no I said that I to audition daw for a book, like Same as you, parang, ah, book? Nice! It's a book. Um, I do know the process of adaptation, and I know it's hard, and it's critical. So, um, I, I took the audition as I usually do, um, hopefully, my best. Um, eh, parang naglaro lang ako ng kami nila directed nun. Nilabis jeans. It was fun. Hindi ko alam nandun si Gwai. Um, and then eventually, sinabi sa akin yung The Rain in Espanya. Alam ng utol ko, alam ng, uh, ng ibang tao, apparently. And apparently, hindi ko pala dapat siya sinasabi. Sorry, direct. Hindi ko pala dapat siya sinasabi. But they know! And sinabi ko na yung, yung role ko, um, they were somehow mad, but mad kasi na, of course, for some of you who has read the book. Yeah, I know. 
Again, why? <laughs> Baka naman tanggapin si Jesus sa dulo. Charot, charot, charot. Um, but um, basically, uh, uh, naramdaman ko yung responsibility na kailangan kong gampanan kasi yun nga, critical. It's, um, ang pag-a-adapt ng book to a film is very, very critical. Because, lalo na for something like this na ang daming lumaki, um, naging part ng buhay nila, they resonated with it. Um, and mas naramdaman ko yung, yung responsibility, like what Marco said, which I want to confirm, yung amount of detail and preparation na nilagay nila direct for us, which was very, very, uh, more than caring, I'd say. Parang sobrang may, may alaga. That's why I hope that for people who are hearing this, I, you give us a chance. Just give us a chance. Because we're doing our very best. And the fun part is, we like it. Gusto namin yung ginagawa namin. We're all very passionate. I can tell you that much. Um, so I feel great. I feel excited for this. I feel... Uh, tama na. <laughs> Responsible. Ayun na. Tama na. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. Um, yes. Hello, everyone. Um, when I was first asked to audition, I also didn't know what the book was about. But I do used to read. And I'm happy to say that after reading The Rain is Fun, it actually got me back into reading, which is a really cool thing. And when I first got accepted, I, same as everyone, I was super proud, super happy, super grateful. And I immediately told my mom and my cousins, because they were also fans of like the series. And they were very excited for me. So I think like the message that we're all trying to relate here is, we really are trying to be true to the source material being provided to us. It is such a blessing to be a part of such a beloved um, series. This book is so well loved, so well received. We want to give the same impact when we put it into a series. And with that being said, that's, that's all I have to say. Thank you so much. Sheesh. <laughs> Thank you to our cast. Thank you very much for answering the question. All right, for our next special, let me call.